Madison, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys what is in my Springborn backpack. I have used this backpack for a long time now, and I'm sure you guys have seen other videos of me showing you what's in it. I typically like to ch change it up, of course, between the different seasons and show season as well. As I've probably said a million times by now, I live smack dab in the middle of the Rocky Mountains of Colorado. So we legitimately had six inches of snow on the ground between November and about a week ago. So I think it was finally time that I switched it up and kind of changed up some things from my winter backpack about the things that I carried in there until now because obviously there's some differences and there are going to be differences, differences between this backpack and the show season one. Either way, without further ado, let's just get up into the video. This is my backpack. This backpack is from Noble Afters, which if you guys have not heard, is now called Noble Equine. This thing has been through thick and thin and I totally, totally recommend it. Right now, it is so heavy and I honestly don't know why it's always so heavy, but I guess we're gonna figure out what I have hiding in here. This backpack, I believe, runs for around $100. I will have it linked down below if you guys are interested in it. Um, it is amazing. I have taken this thing all over the country to different horse shows, different events, everything. It's just like a good go-to backpack. So let's just start off in this front pocket. So there's this big front pocket here, which is meant for your helmet. If you cannot see this with these little mesh pockets, you can tighten these little um, things on the side. Either way, this is meant for your helmet. I never keep my helmet in here just because... I don't, I guess. Either way, in this pocket um, for spring, I have some Vanix. This is just like Vetresin. I personally like it more because it can be used on other pets as well. And it's wound care, it's antifungal, um, helps with rain rot, rain, ringworm scratches, ear infections, fungal and bacterial infections, things like that. This is always just a good preventative measure to put on your horses like cuts, bruises, scratches, things like that. So I totally, totally recommend this. I got this from Dover and I've had this before and I absolutely love it. I also have an extra lead rope. I always have a spare lead rope with me um, unless I like go through my backpack and like dump it out if I'm going to like stable manage for a weekend or something. Um, I guess in that case I could still use one but I guess that's supposed to be part of the pony clip kit. Either way, I always like to have an extra lead rope. Penelope is notoriously known for breaking lead ropes. Honestly, breaks more lead ropes than halters, which, oh well, lead ropes are cheaper. Um, so I just have this one. I really like the cotton ones so much more than the nylon ones, probably, which is why she breaks them because they're a lot easier to break. But either way, I just have that. I also have a jar of horse treats. This thing is normally always filled with snacks with avenger treats. I definitely need to go buy some more though. If you guys are interested in purchasing some snacks with avenger treats, I will have a link at the top of the description below and you guys can just click it and go buy some. These are the peppermint ones and then if you can see that right there, that was like the top of one of their dinosaur ones. Either way, Penelope loves these. I also have a crushed pop tart here but um you know rip to that i also just like to carry some extra drinks and snacks things like that i have some juice and a lacroix right here just because if it ever gets uh if i'm ever thirsty at the barn and i also know that it's not gonna be like cold enough right now where something's gonna freeze so yeah i also have some gum and a luna bar just as a little snack Okay, moving on to my little keychain right here. This, I love this keychain, not gonna lie. Um, in here, I just have this fluff monkey. This basically is just a big fluff ball boot cleaner, um, shiner kind of thing. And it comes in this little keychain. The keychain actually comes with it. 
but basically it just looks like this you can customize your colors you just rub it on your boots to buff them and shine them up I love this also super cute um, just has the little fluff monkey tag right there and I totally recommend these if you guys are interested in buying one I will also have a link to these because I love this and it's so cute I just need to get one of my cross country colors next because why not have another one <laughs> on here I also have spare hair ties just this little Mickey Mouse thing a ton of random stuff my two most three most beneficial things are my fluff pump monkey my bundle of hair ties and this fake key is actually a knife this thing is awesome for cutting bailing twine if you ever find one of these it's definitely a great tool to have okay moving on to the next back pocket I'm just gonna yank this stuff out of here because there's a lot going on um, in here there are two of these mesh pockets on the back and in the top one I keep things like an extra phone charger, headphones, as well as my awesome time watch. Not totally sure why I leave that in there but oh well at least I always know where it is. And in the bottom one I just keep things like tissues and medicine. Um, and an extra pair of sunglasses in case I forget mine. I don't like to wear my nice sunglasses to the barn. I used to like these things, but then I legitimately left them in the arena for an entire winter. So they got all scratched up, and I don't really know how much I like them anymore. Either way, there's that. And in this big main pocket right here, I always carry a hairbrush, a hat, just basic like essentials and the winter of course this is like a hat, gloves, um, ear warmers, things like that. I also like to bring my GoPro with me. I have my GoPro in here just in case I decide I want to do something epic that day or film whatever I'm doing. Um, I have my GoPro and a charger in here. I also carry a notebook and some pencils with me. This is awesome for if you decide to teach a lesson, help with a lesson, learn something, um, I don't know, I always just like to have this. Also, if you're bored, I don't know, notebooks are good. Okay, additionally, I just have this jelly scrubber. Um, these, honestly, I should take this out of the package. This is a new one, but I always like to keep little extra brush, brush essentials in my backpack because I use them so, so, so much. Um, this is awesome for bathing, for legs, for the fine side soft or good on their face. These things are honestly so good for everything under the sun. So I always like to keep an extra brush like this left in my, or curry comb type thing left in my backpack. And the rest of this honestly is just random little things. Um, this is a little cooling thing. I've never actually used this, but one of my bar friends got this for me. You like soak it in water and put it around your neck when it's super hot outside. Do not have this in the winter. Um, have an extra bag of treats, peppermints, you know, things like that. Oh, and then going along with this, I always just like to carry an extra hoof pick. This is an ultimate hoof pick. This is one of the smaller ones with like the smaller handle because the other ones are kind of hard to grip. These things are amazing for like snowballs, rocks, like heavy like really lodged in their stuck things. Definitely worth it. Okay, and then in this last back pocket, or I guess the last big one, if I don't have um, my computer in here, if I'm going to like a show or something really far away, I guess I always have this in here. This is my HB notebook for every, I'll talk about this in another video, but for every one of my ratings, I always get a new notebook. And the entire thing basically is every single thing I need to know for that rating handwritten because writing things helps you memorize it more so types of feed nutrition there's my tax stuff lameness arthritis this is all about toxic plants um confirmation things like that i can go through this more later in another video if you guys would like me to with pony club stuff but um i always just like to have something that's updated towards my like most recent rating with me if I'm going to take more notes or need help with something or remind myself of something. And then I always just have a pencil hooked on the edge of this. And in this little back pocket right here, 
I just have little random things like a coin purse, coin purse with some spare change. I'll have some chapstick and some lotion. I also have a ton of pins in here that I got at Young Riders last year. Um, like US Equestrian pins. What is this? Oh, FBI NAYC pins. You know, things like that. And then, of course, on the sides here, if you can see this, oh gosh. And then, of course, on the sides here, I have just this water bottle holder, and then this little small pocket right here with the strap is for your crop, if that makes any sense. Basically, this is like ultimate backpack. There's a spot for your crop, your water bottle, and your helmet all right here, which is so awesome if you're actually looking to have a backpack and like use those features i totally recommend this backpack again i will have it linked down below if you guys are interested in checking it out thank you guys so much for watching today's video i love you all so much and i will see you on my next one peace out bye